Right, let's have a look what we've got. It says you have a go working out these codes. The alphabet is here to help you. This kind of question, they will always give you the alphabet. So the code for hand is I B O E. What does G I mm, get this carefully? G J T I stand for. Now, this is the way to do it. If they give you the word, you count from the word to the code. If they give you the code, you count from the code to the word. So what have they given us? The code. So you count from the code to word. Now I'm going to put myself a little arrow in there just to remind myself because it can get tricky. Now the sad thing is I haven't got, um, we're not in person, I have to do this on screen, but the fact of the matter is, is you need to sort of have your hand across the alphabet here and one on the question, otherwise it will go one up and down to the other. So off we go. We go from the code, they gave us the code, so you go from the code to the letter. So I to H is back one. B to A is back one. O to N is back one. Always do the first four. E to D is back one. And the reason to do it always four is it could be minus two, minus two, minus two, minus three, minus two, minus four. So always do the first three. So G minus one F. J minus one I. T minus one S. I minus one H. Now, is that a word? Fish. Yes, it is. If you end up with something that doesn't look like a word, you know something's gone wrong. So I'm going to have to scrub this out, I'm afraid, on this one. I think there's probably a way of capturing it, but um, I'm not quite sure how. Well, we, should we try it? But then I might get rid of my alphabet. I don't know. Should we do it? Control. Oh, we didn't want that, did we? Should we just deselect it? That felt a bit scary. Did you feel scared? You didn't, did you? I did. Right, the code for road, R-O-A-D, is T-M-C-B. What is the code for lorry? Now, had they given us the word or the code? The word. So they give us the word, you count from the word to the code. Off we go. R to T is forwards, one, two. So it's plus two. O to M is is O oh, back to yeah, be careful with this one A to C is forwards one two D to B is back one two right now we know it's all two so I'm just going to write a little plus minus plus minus plus now notice that on a multiple choice they'll give you a selection of letters that will go minus plus minus plus minus so be very careful this one started on a plus so l plus two one two n o back to one two m r plus two one two t r minus two one two p y plus two one go round the alphabet Ooh. Nimipta. Now that is a code, and we wanted a code, didn't we? Um, so let's get rid of this. It's very noisy. Should we have a stupid noise whilst we do it? Felt a bit better, didn't it? Right, the next one is E B O B. Oh no. It was the code for here is E B O B E Bob. What does T E X Q stand for? Have they given us the code? Good. It's the code so we we count from the code to the word. If they gave us the word, we'd count from the word to the code, but they give us the code, so we count from the code to the word. 
Don't ever get seduced into saying you do it backwards because they could just write the question the other way around and then it's forwards. So off we go. E to H is forwards one, two, three, plus three. B to E is forwards one, two, three. O to R is forwards one, two, three. And B to E is forwards one, two, three. Plus three every which way. T plus three. One, two, three. W. E plus three. One, two, three. H. X plus three. Round the end of the alphabet. One, two, three. A. And then Q plus three. One, two, three. What? Ta-da! Oh, no, we can't do it, can we? Should we have another noise? Uh, give me a number between 1 and 16. Oh, that was a good one. That wasn't such a good noise, was it? Go on then, give me another number between 1 and 16. No, you can't have that one again. Right. The code for street is T S S. D F S. Let's try this. T S S D F S. Uh, what is the code for path? Now, have they given us the word or the code? It's the word. So we count from the word to the code. If they gave us a code, we'd count from the code to the word. But it wasn't. It was a word. So the word to the code. I told you it would get tedious. And isn't it? Yes, it is. In fact, shall we shoot ourselves? That was in bad taste, wasn't it? Off we go. So S to T is plus one. T to S ooh, is back one. R to S is forwards one. E to D is back one. I was getting myself into a confusal there. Always do the first four. And we starting on a plus, minus, plus, minus. We know it's one all the way. So P plus one is Q. A minus one round the end is Z. T plus one is U. And H minus one, G. Is that the last one? Oh, no, we've got one more to go. Um, right. Go on then, give me another thing whilst I start rubbing out. Shout a number out between 1 and 16. Okay, off you go. Did you know that was going to be clapping? Because you weren't clapping me, were you? No. Ah, oh, let's do... I think we could choose that at the end, couldn't we? Right, the code for flower is E J L S Z L E J L S Z L. What does C G D H stand for? So, have they given us the word or the code? Code, well done. So, we count from the code. To the word put the arrow there because so e to f is plus one j to l is plus one two l to o is plus one two three aha i think i know where this is going and then s to w is plus one two three four now we know it's all plus, so we're just going to write one, two, three, four. So C plus one is D, G plus two, one, two is I. D plus three, one, two, three. And H plus four, one, two, three, four. What have I done wrong? Diddle. That's never right, is it? Aha, right, come on. We can work this out together. 
Yes, we can without any silly noises. Um, the code for flower. So I've got, I've, and it was plus one, wasn't it? Oh, no, it wasn't. Why didn't you tell me? You knew, you knew that was going wrong, didn't you? And you didn't say. Why didn't you say? What do you mean you were saying? You could have shouted out loud. I would have heard. Yes, I would. I mean, you could have done. You didn't. You knew it was going wrong. Have they given us the code? They've given us the code from the word. So we count from the code to the word. So it is E to F is plus, it is plus one, isn't it? Plus one. It definitely is. I think what's happened is that Rachel's written this and it goes the other one. So that's plus one. Because she wanted this, she wanted the answer to be B. Okay. So it would, that would be minus one, wouldn't it? Yeah. And then G minus one is F. Oh, minus two we wanted. Minus three, minus four. She should have written this right the other way around. So anyway, C minus one, B, G minus two, one, two, E, D minus three, one, two, three, A, and H minus four, one, two, three, four. Do you know I've got myself into a complete confusal now? Because E plus one is definitely F, isn't it? What I think she should have done is had that written the other way around and said, because if we do it this way, puff, puff, puff. I'll go and have a word, and in the meantime, we'll have a boing. Ready? Bye.